fundamental elements. Have you ever heard about the fundamental elements of life? There are six fundamental elements in life. They are security. Security is one of the most important necessities in life and everyone needs it. Since we always require a certain amount of comfort and security, the security motivated people enjoy living an organized life. When doing things, they are willing to persist in some specific steps or procedures and predictable results. Before getting involved in something, they prefer to know the details in advance. Familiar surroundings and people Familiar fields make them more comfortable and less willing to accept changes. Besides, preparation will be made before starting any activity. Next is diversity. People who represent diversity become easily bored with activities which is too safe and familiar. Then, they want to be challenged and changed to make their life much more fantastic. Diversity motivated people want to change constantly and enjoy a challenging life. When they do things, they are the opportunities that bring challenges. They are curious about life. They like to explore other fields. They are also willing to take risks and not afraid of trying new things. It's not a big deal to communicate with people at all. If a job doesn't bring challenges and changes, they don't hesitate to change jobs. They like the challenge of the unknown and are more driven by it. The third one is importance. Importance is one of the most important necessities for us. They emphasize their value and significance. They love unique and care. People who represent importance need to emphasize their value and significance. They love unique and care about acknowledgement. They are driven by acknowledgement. They strive for significance. How to stand out, how to be unique. Sometimes people of importance are easily motivated by value and acknowledgement. They want to share their knowledge in conversations and they are willing to help others with every conversation. They like to win and they must be number one. The fourth one, is relational. The need for relationships is our need for love in life. All people need to feel loved and to love. Relational people are more likely to connect with others. They like to communicate with people, connect with people, and they value relationships. Relationships in their lives are important and they enjoy serving others. They often fear loneliness and strive to be included. And if they don't get enough love, they try to get connection in a positive way. If they cannot find love or connection in a positive way, they will take it in a negative way. They care a lot about what other people think. These are the four core necessities. These needs are not what we demand, desire, or deliberately express, but what we are born with. We are meeting these necessities in whatever activities or decisions we make, consciously or subconsciously. The next two necessities can be achieved with self-discipline and conscious mindset. Expansion. Everything in the world is growing. If it isn't growing, it is dying. So as people, it is necessary we pursue the expansion of life. People that make expansion an important necessity prefer to study what they don't know, study constantly, and have a high standard for their life. Have the attitude and concept that it is never too late to learn. Have a high degree of self-discipline for learning. Sharing. People who continue to learn will also continue to expand their ability to share. Sharing what you've learned and what you've benefited from is also a necessity of life. Sharing is the only source of a sense of achievement, the ultimate sense of achievement for each person. 
People who are willing to share enjoy the satisfaction that comes from sharing, and people who are constantly learning are more likely to keep sharing. People who like to learn and share are the best team members. <laughs>